Today we are out here harvesting mountain huckleberry. I was invited up by a Tulalip tribal member to come and gather in their usual and accustomed area here in East King County in the North Cascades. Mountain huckleberry grows really only above about 3,000 foot elevation, this specific variety. This variety of huckleberry is found in the subalpine and alpine area. You're going to find them on really steep slopes. Traveling up into those areas is really difficult. Um, and then once you move up into the berry fields, you're having to navigate uh, those hillsides and that really steep terrain. Huckleberries are a traditional food that provide amazing nutrition. They are the highest fruit in antioxidants, as far as antioxidants go in the Pacific Northwest. And those super high antioxidants allow for good heart health, it helps regulate cholesterol, it helps balance and regulate your metabolism. They are extremely high in iron, so they're, they're a blood builder, which is really good going into that winter season. They're high in vitamin A, vitamin B, and vitamin C. And so they really will help support your immune system going into the cold and the flu season. The mountain huckleberry is one of the most like culturally significant late summer berries as far as gathering goes. Part of the reason is that this is the headwaters of the rivers. So as people are moving inland following the fish, um, they move up into these huckleberry areas. And so these would become areas of trade, of commerce, of community where people were coming together to gather and share in that experience and share in the gathering up our natural resources. And so culturally, this berry is more than just a food. It was also about the life and times of, of the people and the way um, uh, we moved through those seasons. This is one of the last big harvests of fruit um, at the end of the season. And so this would have been that last push to really make sure that our tummies could be full through that winter season when there aren't any berries to gather. This particular place is a restoration project that was done in partnership between the United States Forest Service and the Tulalip Tribes Natural Resource Department. And this experience is really the perfect combination of tribal ecological knowledge coming together with our tribal values and tribal health. And when we have these types of places and projects that can bring the community together to access those foods that sustain a healthy tribe, we are revitalizing health into our tribes and into our people.